In 1912, Percy and Lessie Dunbar's four-year-old child Bobby Dunbar disappeared near Swayze Lake when he wandered off during a camping trip. Search parties failed to find Bobby, and was declared deceased, until new evidence emerged that suggests he may have been kidnapped. Police arrested a known peddler named William Cantwell Walters, who was accompanied by a young boy the same age and general appearance as Bobby Dunbar. Walters claimed the boy was Bruce Anderson, the illegitimate son of Julia Anderson, which she confirmed, although she claimed he was only supposed to be with him for a few days, whilst Bruce had been with Walter for almost a year. Strangely though, Anderson had never reported her son missing the entire time. The Dunbars would controversially identify and claim Bruce as their lost child Bobby. A DNA test, years later from relatives would reveal that Bobby Dunbar was in fact, Julia Anderson's son Bruce. No one knows till this day what happened to the real Bobby Dunbar.